Despite Southwest Michigan's long-standing racial segregation, Novi exists as a bubble of racial diversity. In fact, there are now more students of color at Novi than white students. This has created a culturally rich environment with students from many different nations speaking dozens of different languages and practicing numerous different religions. For example, Farah Osemi, who moved to Novi from Egypt, is one of the few Muslim students who wears a headscarf at Novi High School. As with some women, like, what the main reason, like, first and foremost, the main reason why we wear a headscarf is because we want people to know that we're Muslims. It's kind of like a mark that says, yes, we're Muslims. And the fact that, like, Muslim women or Muslim teenagers, just like me, wear a headscarf, just like, they make a statement, they just tell the people out there, I'm a Muslim. And I find that actually a brave step <laughs> in itself. Uh, the second part is like to protect her beauty. You know, like hair makes you look beautiful. And the fact that we wear a headscarf, it just protects your beauty. And like you'll always look beautiful and just it allows the people to look on who you are as a person and judge you based on your personality, not based on how you look and stuff. Yeah, actually people were really accepting and I loved it like people were really curious they had like a lot of questions and I loved their cur curiosity like it wasn't bothering me at all so yeah in Nova High School and in the community in general people were so so accepting of course not every Muslim woman has the same experiences even with the election of the first two Muslim women to Congress last year discrimination and violence are still common parts of many Muslim women's lives I would probably say like they took a really brave step in like t putting that headscarf on and like walking with it in the streets in a community where it's not really popular, it's, right, it's not really common for people to wear a headscarf. And with what's going on around the world with ISIS and terrorists and stuff, it's quite a brave step to, for people to actually do that. And so basically the fact that you did that, the fact that you you put that headscarf on because you want people to know that you're a Muslim, that you're a brave Muslim. That's a great step. Like there are there are a lot of people, a lot of great people out there that will appreciate you for who you are. And you're pretty the way you are. So <laughs> honestly, boo them. <laughs> this is Win Scott with the Cat's Eye News.